Welcome to Game On Review. My name is Michael. We shall be talking about Red Dead Redemption 2, which will be released later this year. Uh, it was based on the original game, which was released in 2010, which made it very successful. We shall be playing you a trailer for you right now. Wanted man, Mr. Morgan. Maybe when your mother's finished mourning your father, I'll keep her in black on your behalf. We'll be going over to Paula in Sydney. So today we are talking about Red Dead Redemption 2. The first game in the series was a smash success by selling over 11 million copies by August 2011. So James, do you believe this success could be repeated with a new game? Absolutely, 100%. Um, if we take a look back at the Rockstar games and what they've done with GTA, um, game by game they've got bigger and better. Um, so yeah, I'm 100% confident that they're going to do exactly the same with Red Dead Redemption. So yeah. Fantastic. So I am also a big fan of GTA. I completely love the GTA 5, the characters, the engine of the game, the scenery, the story. Um, but then when my older brother bought the Red Dead Redemption game, I was quite taken back. There was a westernized game that was done by The Rock. So what's your thoughts on the first game? Well, if I go back to the first western game I played, um, it had been Gun, um, and I played that for the PlayStation 2. And I loved that game simply down to it being a western. Um, it was the first one I'd played, and ever since I've kind of waited for a, a bigger and better one. Um, and Rockstar brought that to us, and hopefully they're going to bring it even bigger and better one with Red Dead Redemption 2. Fantastic. So the things that I like about Red Dead Redemption, it still has that sort of feeling, the essence from Rockstar. So it's an open world, you can interact with the characters, so we have mini missions going on in there. So do you hope seeing those features or better features in the new game? Um, well, obviously Rockstar are known for um, the amazing characters that they bring to a game it, it's almost like a movie um but also the the campaign that they have offline you know they always have great storylines um but one thing that i am looking forward to is the online with red dead redemption 2 um because obviously the uh, gta 5 and the success of that online you know uh, hopefully it's going to be um same with red dead redemption 2 really so yeah, yeah i'm, I'm kind of looking yeah i'm kind of looking forward to that <laughs> Um, so talking about online, so today it was leaked that it will the Red, Redem the Red Dead Redemption 2 will have something called the Companion app. What's your thoughts on that? Um, well, to me, it won't have a massive impact on the gameplay or, um, you know, in the game itself, but it's just one of those small details that kind of shows that they're kind of doing everything they can to kind of maximise the, the player's experience. So mm -hmm. it, you know, it gives me a good idea of how much work they're putting into the game, so I'm pretty much happy with that. So, any sort of advice for people that can have for the game? Um, well, I think we just have to kind of wait and see. I think they're being quite quiet and, um, you know, what they're doing with the game, and that kind of shows me that they've got something big in store for us. So, yeah, I think we just have to hold tight and wait. Right then, fantastic. Okay then, thanks for joining me today, James. Now back to Michael in London. Thank you, Paula. I think that's all we have left time for today. So thank you, Paula, and I hope you guys enjoy the game as much as I will. Goodbye.